The following contest is a triple threat tag team match. On the way to the ring, at a combined weight of 370 pounds, the world tag team champions, Finn Balor and J.D. McDonough, the Judgment Day. Ever since I took my spot here at the commentary table, I have wanted to call this match. I cannot wait to finally do it. I hope everybody enjoyed their turkey as we prepare to kick this match off momentarily. You know what, guys? Aside from my family, I can't think of two other people I'd rather spend Thanksgiving with. In fact, I go so far as to say that you guys are like family to me. Uh, Happy Thanksgiving, fellas. like these with talent of this caliber this is why sports entertainment is an art form and guys what a thrill it must be for these superstars to compete here on thanksgiving especially considering what this day has meant to this industry over the years for decades thanksgiving was considered one of the biggest nights of sports entertainment and that tradition continues here tonight Look who's here! And at a combined weight of 429 pounds, the WWE Tag Team Champions, the Bloodline! The tension building for this match is so thick you can cut it with a knife. A lot of drama involved with this one. And let me take this opportunity to say happy Thanksgiving to all of you watching tonight. I gotta say, I don't know if it's because I ate too much turkey or if it's just Saxton's commentary. It's a good thing this match coming up is gonna give me a little boost. It's Saxton's commentary. Tornado tag with multiple teams facing off. Things are going to get frantic fast. Whatever team comes out of this with their hand raised is going to make a strong case for being the best in WWE. Because when it's no disqualification, it's not considered interference. It's legal. The match can change in an instant when another individual who is not officially part of the match makes their presence felt. That's when a competitor needs to utilize the anything go stipulation to their benefit and eliminate the mismatch. Ah, snap air takedown. And a, that was just wrong. You should be a better person than that. And after that shot to the knee, what could be next? Intimidation. I'm not 
sure if it's resilience or stupidity that's going to drive you to try and come back from a move like that. Shoved into the ropes and attacking the lower back. Quick reflex is so important in a match like this. Balor retaliates. He's got a candlestick. He can end it here. But now we see Balor. And he powers out. He's determined to keep this matchup going. Into a superplex. When all else fails, sometimes you just have to go the high risk and hopefully high reward. The better part of Valor.
The pit bull has been released. The following contest has an elimination match. Introducing first, representing the Creed Brothers from Knoxville, Tennessee, Ivy Nile. You know, Ivy Nile is not the biggest woman around, but Nile has honed her body into a finely tuned weapon. And guys, what a thrill it must be for these superstars to compete here on Thanksgiving. Especially considering what this day has meant to this industry over the years. For decades, Thanksgiving was considered one of the biggest nights of sports entertainment. And that tradition continues here tonight. She is a woman reborn in fire. The longest reigning NXT UK Women's Champion looking to continue her dominance in WWE. And her partners from Glasgow, Scotland. Alba Fire! Easily the most dominant woman in NXT UK history. She held the women's title for 649 days. And in NXT, she won the Dusty Rhodes Classic alongside EO Sky. Well, no matter what brand she's on, her name is always in the title picture. How do you think these superstars feel about competing here on Thanksgiving? They should feel honored, Cole. As you know, Thanksgiving has a long-standing tradition of being one of the more prestigious nights on the sports entertainment calendar. One of the all-time greats in the women's division, the Empress of Tomorrow. And from Osaka, Japan, Asuka! Think about this, gentlemen. Asuka has a combined 914 days without defeat in NXT and WWE. And Asuka has remained dominant even after that historical streak. And let me take this opportunity to say happy Thanksgiving to all of you watching tonight. I gotta say, I don't know if it's because I ate too much turkey or if it's just Saxton's commentary. It's a good thing this match coming up is going to give me a little boost. It's Saxton's commentary. One of the most dominant forces the women's division has ever seen, Rhea Ripley. The Eradicator is here. And from Adelaide, Australia, Rhea Ripley! Physically imposing and a talented athlete. This is a woman who knows how to put her strength to devastating use. Uh, Rhea Ripley is capable of anything inside the ring. You've got to respect that.
And guys, what a thrill it must be for these superstars to compete here on Thanksgiving. Especially considering what this day has meant to this industry over the years. For decades, Thanksgiving was considered one of the biggest nights of sports entertainment. And that tradition continues here tonight. She even competed on the U.S. national team. She sprang her way into WWE after that and has never looked back. We've learned very quickly that it's always tippy time in WWE. Meechin ready to bring a beatdown. Now she's still the head baddie in charge, but now she's also too sweet. And representing the OC from Fontana, California, Meechin! The HBIC of WWE looking to carve a name for herself and leave her mark on sports entertainment. Look, there's no doubt Meet Shin has all the tools to do just that. But can she put them together and reach the top? I hope everybody enjoyed their turkey as we prepare to kick this match off momentarily. You know what, guys? Aside from my family, I can't think of two other people I'd rather spend Thanksgiving with. In fact, I go so far as to say that you guys are like family to me. Oh. Happy Thanksgiving, fellas. Mrs. Wrestling has returned. And from Riverside, California, Candice LeRae. One of the most decorated female superstars in the world. Surprising ability in such a small package. And let me take this opportunity to say happy Thanksgiving to all of you watching tonight. I gotta say, I don't know if it's because I ate too much turkey or if it's just Saxton's commentary. It's a good thing this match coming up is gonna give me a little boost. It's Saxton's commentary. Oh, great. You know, I have something I need to say about... It's Chelsea. And from Victoria, British Columbia, Canada, Chelsea Green! You know, I actually heard that Chelsea Green is the kind of person that'll order a huge salad, eat the whole thing, and then complain to the manager that something was wrong with it. Um, that's not out of the ordinary. It's like wrestling a great match and then learning afterwards that you, Byron, did commentary on it. <sighs> and guys, what a thrill it must be for these superstars to compete here on Thanksgiving. Especially considering what this day has meant to this industry over the years. For decades, Thanksgiving was considered one of the biggest nights of sports entertainment. And that tradition continues here tonight. Teams in their respective corners for tonight's tag team contest. In this one, we get a chance to see Ivy Nile, Alba Fire, Asuka, and Rhea Ripley. And in the other corner, they will be dealing with Tiffany Stratton, Meechin, Candice LeRae, and Chelsea Green. Quick tags and staying fresh are imperative in a tag match. The question is, how to provide some stay? Is it time to fit? Couple of right hands and that creates space and separation. Chop block. Brilliant. Right to the back of the knee. Targeted the lower body there, and it was highly effective. 
Left by the turnbuckles. Quickly, the cover! Power is through after two. We'll see if this is the start of a rally. What a hot shot. Sent all the way to the outside. She anticipated that one. She can do it here. Kicks out on the pinfall attempt. She's still in this one. Uh oh. This has been incredible tag team action all night tonight. This could be the end of it all, though. Oh, stomping right through his sternum. They finish each other's sentences. They finish each other's moves. That's tag team excellence right there, gentlemen. Nile gets out of there. And that failed to hit the mark. Big elbows right to the body. Oh, look at this. I love it. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. There's the tag. From the middle. Oh, from the middle. Here's a cover. She's quick to get her shoulder up. Just looking for ways to wear out her opponent. Tag made. Tag made. Point of the elbow. Nailed it. Great strength being shown here. Oh, right across the throat. Oh, debilitating elbow drop. Elbow drop! <laughs> Snap, man, right. Surfboard. Oh, what a reversal. Great move. She needs to get out of here in a hurry. Turnbuckle's the only thing keeping her upright. In full control here, face first in the turnbuckle. Dismantling the arm in the corner. Gotta hurt. That kind of force in the arm can have lingering effects. On the throat in the corner. That's telling your opponent, you don't deserve to share this stage with me. My God, enough! And here's Asuka. Hit up the tag. Tag. Here she comes. <laughs> up and around. Down with a tilt the world backbreaker. Can you believe this? I love it. It has to be demoralizing to just get slapped like that. If that doesn't fire you up, I don't know what will. And a series of vicious stomps. And if the first stomp doesn't send you the message, the follow-up ones definitely will. Stomp after stomp. Relentless. Uh-oh. Able to evade. Looks like someone wants to shove Tiffany's silver spoon down her throat. Yeah, Asuka looked confident going on the attack. She's tagged in. Oh, that hurt to the spine. Picking the spot. Dropping the elbow. Oh, and targeting the knee. Vicious, aggressive attacks. Isolating the foot. DDT. Leg trapped. Looking for the heel hook stretch. Oh, that's going to hurt. Oh, targeting the leg there. We don't often see Asuka in this position. Rare to see Asuka in distress like this. Stretched out like Taffy right now. 
Looking for a suplex. Into a suplex of their own. Momentum going back to Asuka's corner. Brief sign of adrenaline from Asuka. Oh, that gets reversed on LeRae. Pinpointing the leg. Punishing the leg. She manages to get control. These two showing how well scouted they each are. Boom! So she's going for it. Shoulders up before two. Wow. Tag made. Arm ringer applied. Look out! Wicked forearm! Did you hear that thud? The scary queen of Scots with a royal gesture to the crowd here. Able to get there in time. With the going ball! Cover! Two count kick out! She still has life! She just will not go away. Ah, oh, look at this! Hair pull back slam! She's enduring some damage. Up across the shoulders. Down in a sit-out spine buster. Into the corner. This can't be good. She still fights out in one. She is still in this fight. Now tagging her in. Ah, oh, look at this. Hair pull net slam. Wait, 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 wait. Kicks out after one. Somehow still in this fight. Not down and out yet. Chelsea Green about to close this one down. Quick back elbow. Detours that offense. She steers clear of that one. What a close line. Ouch. She sent flying into the corner. Oh, just making their opponent suffer with their boot. Oh. Absolutely punishing. Uses the edge of the knee. Fry quick to counter. In full control here. Face full of turnbuckle. Solely focused on. Ooh. Now, uh, Fireman's carry. Right into a spine buster. Oh, what a headbutt. Paying it right back with a reversal. Oh! Super kick! Four under the jaw. Both knees into the face. Tagged in. Bringing the arm. Ooh, what? Wasn't expecting that. And one more reversal. Talk about evenly matched here. Sidewalk slam. Tagging her partner in. And she makes it to her partner. Tag. Big form. Brought down. All oh, impact to the stomach. Stop 
stopped in her tracks. Oh, across the top rope. And Candice being out wrestled there. Yeah, and it seems Asuka's just getting warmed up in terms of that endless supply of intensity Cole mentioned. The knee right on the temple. Cover! Oh, no, I thought it was over. Oh, grief, this is chaotic. Come on, ref. We could be close to the end of the line for Asuka. I think the crowd knows what we're about to see. Will that stop Asuka? Cover. And there's the save. Meanwhile, here's Rhea Ripley. Oh, man. Kick to the gut. Here's the setup. Look at a torch of their opponent. Uh oh, this isn't going to be good. Oh, man. Taking a moment to get pumped off of this crowd's incredible energy. And just planting them with that DDT there. Kick to the lower back. You can see it in these superstars' faces. They're in serious pain at the moment. Well, a lot of punishment has been dished out, but no one is thinking about quitting. Meechin sidesteps out of that. Made her pay for her mistake. A well-timed dodge. Up and around and down. Can she do it here? Digging deep for a kick out. So, so close. That could have been it. Ripley not backing down and letting her know it. Oh, just deadlifting their opponent. Tossing their opponent like they're nothing. Put into the corner now. Uh-oh, here it comes. Inverted Alabama slam. Fire scaling the turnbuckles. Oh, it's gonna happen. On the fire with the swan time. Will fire finish things now? And they're still in this. shifts that to her favor. Wow, belly on belly. Oh, look at the knees. Precision strikes. And she's stunned in the corner. Will it be? It off. She just dug down deep there, but I don't know if she'll be able to do it again. Mi Chin is taking a moment to soak it all in. Got the tag. Got the tag. Oh, clothesline. Torturous focus on the leg. Ooh. No, trapping the arm. A vicious stomps to the hand. Goodness gracious. Looking wobbly in the corner. Uh-oh. Reversal! What a counter! Caught with a punch. Meanwhile, it's Alba. Great awareness as he proves to be too quick. 
listen to this crowd. What a feeling. And these superstars are feeling it too. She turns it around on Meechan. Reaches her partner. Tag. Just in time. Face first off the knee. Vicious, downright savage club right there. Ripley has things right where she wants them. Here we go. Rhea with the riptide. Can Candace come back from that? Two. And they're still in this. Candace is hanging tough in this do or die situation. It's harder than it seems to survive and keep alive your dreams. And Ripley is stunned right now. So many opponents have fallen to that move, but not this one. Patented maneuver out of the Ivy Nile playbook for the Dragon Sleeper. Uh-oh, the end is near. No way she survives this. I think she's gonna... Look at this. She releases the hold. That's a little surprising, no? Oh, Rick, she covers for the pin. Lorraine falls short. She's eliminated. Has been eliminated. Just driven into the mat. <laughs> DDT spiked. All the way up. The power of a gut wrench suplex. She might be in some trouble now. This is what the purpose of a tag team is. Don't be afraid to use the resources and help your partner offers. Am I being diplomatic enough, Cole? Might take her head clean off her shoulders. Asuka gets tagged in. There's the takedown. Oh, kick connects. There's no shame in giving up now. Looks like she has other plans here. I think she was just looking to soften her up a little there. Places her right in the corner. Oh, strikes with the back elbow. Arse forearm draped across the middle rope. Yes, tag. And down. Ooh. She scores big with the count. Oh, my gosh! They are fading off the WWE fans, now pinning the arm down, and oh, stop right to the hand. By the throat into the top rope. Oof. What a punch! Boot to the stomach gives them separation. Dismantling the arm in the corner. Gotta mm. hurt. In full control here. Face first. Oh, and Ivy caught her. Boom, right in the button. Nile gets out of there. There's a Canadian destroyer. Wow. Is it enough? The cover. Now back to Ripley. Chelsea Green looking to remind everyone, I'm prettier. Wow, Chelsea got her. Oh. What a wrist clutch suplex. Cover. There's two. Uh, Chelsea Green has been eliminated. Powell's position to be in right now. Ooh, dropped right on their face. Assisted drop kick. Uh oh. Thunderous power bomb. Tag is.
is made. Amateur takedown all the way over. Stratton grounds their opponent while she ascends up. Oh. Quick shoot, Stratton bomb. Niles on her last breath. Nothing more she can do. Abby Niles has been eliminated. Oh, so lighten up the chest. Everyone is on their feet in this building. Absolutely showing the respect for all the exertion these athletes are putting each other through. Air whip! Right to the spine. Sent into the corner. right through his sternum. Uh-oh. Crafty way to get out of harm there. <laughs> wow, belly on his belly. Tagged into action. Oh, that'll send a shock down your spine. Oh, man, right to the arm. Hyperextend your elbow. Ooh, sidewalk slam. Look at this. Snap suplex. Uh-oh, submission move. Fujiwara on bar. Oh, my. Rolls through, clever escape, and a knee. She's on unsteady legs in the corner, needs to recover. Oh, right to the body. Just hot shot it to the outside. She's lost some of that energy she had earlier. Heading into this kind of match, you have to prepare yourself mentally and physically for this kind of abuse. We are getting everyone in attendance to rally behind her. You can tell she wants to put an end to this. Big time clothesline. Good grief. Ooh, face first. She's in. Planted face first. The powerhouse, Rhea Ripley looking to force her opponent into submission. Trying to get her to tap out. What's going to happen? Here? And there's the save. Looking worse for wear in the corner now. Face full of turnbuckle. Using their boot. Scouted. Buries a knee to the body, and what is going on here? Uh oh, the tarantula cinched in with the tarantula. 
Oh. Oh. Big form. Fails to connect on the springboard. Nasty kick to the face. Shoulders down. And Meacham is now gone from this match. Eliminated. Slam! What impact. Both arms captured. And vitriolic stops. Trying to wrestle free their opponent's arm. Has the arm trapped. And a series of vicious stops. And here's Asuka. Hit off the tag. Big time clothesline. Good grief. Producing a trampling. Got their opponent set up. Drop kick to the back. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. She saw that coming from Tiffany. Look at Asuka. Endless strikes. And she lets her out of the submission. I don't know if it's Mercy or if it's someone who's not done playing with their prey. She's pushed into the corner. In full control here. Face first in the turnbuckle. Brutal forearm. She's got an answer for that. Disrupts the attack with an elbow to the gut. Stratton turns it around. Ooh! Horse forearm draped across the middle rope. Fireman's carry position. Uh oh! Stiff elbow will break that up. Going counter for counter. Now, can it be capitalized on? Not a single person in this place is sitting down. We might just be watching one of the greatest matches we've seen in quite some time here. Able to reverse. Oh, shotgun drop kick. In off the tag. This is uh this is awkward, guys. Not quite sure that's the word I'd use, but nonetheless. Over and over. That got bad real quick. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. And she'll make the tag. Cranking the arm, and a kick and a punch. Punishing the targeted area of the arm with the assist of the rope. Basement drop kick. Shot in the corner from Stratton, and it appears to be Tiffy time with a corkscrew Stratton bomb. Will Tiffany put it away here? Oh my goodness, dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. Momentum really on Stratton's side now. A series of... She's got it, got her shoulders down. every other team in this match. Here are your winners. The team of Ivy Nile, Alba Fire, Asuka, and Rhea Ripley. And there you have it. 
the last superstar standing. Yeah, what a match. We are about to see something good. The following contest is a triple threat match. Making his way to the ring from Lagos, Nigeria. Weighing in at 273 pounds, the NXT North American Champion, Oh. I'm all for tough competition, but this one likes to take things too far. Their matches can be downright gruesome sometimes, the way they go after their opponent. This industry isn't about being gentle, Saxton. You have to be a little mean sometimes to ensure the win. If anything, I think the intensity can be turned up in the ring. And let me take this opportunity to say happy Thanksgiving to all of you watching tonight. I gotta say, I don't know if it's because I ate too much turkey or if it's just Saxton's commentary. It's a good thing this match coming up is going to give me a little boost. It's Saxton's commentary. This is going to be physical. Already a multiple time NXT champion looking to dominate all of NXT. And his opponents from Woodstock, Georgia, weighing in at 230 pounds, the WWE Intercontinental Champion, Braun Breaker! Within two years of his debut, he won the NXT Championship twice and unified it with the NXT UK title. Many more titles in this young man's future. Corey, how do you think these superstars feel about competing here on Thanksgiving? They should feel honored, Cole. As you know, Thanksgiving has a long-standing tradition of being one of the more prestigious nights on the sports entertainment calendar. The WWE Universe just exploded. That's because L.A. Knight is here. And yeah. from Los Angeles, California, weighing in at 241 pounds, the WWE United States Champion, L.A. Knight. Knight made headlines when he became a breakout superstar. Now he's on the type of ascent that can't be stopped. I hope everybody enjoyed their turkey as we prepare to kick this match off momentarily. You know what, guys? Aside from my family, I can't think of two other people I'd rather spend Thanksgiving with. In fact, I go so far as to say that you guys are like family to me. Uh, Happy Thanksgiving, fellas. Three superstars in the ring, and here we go with our triple threat match. Three determined superstars, I'd say. They all believe this is their match to win. Well, I did the math, and they've each got a clean 33.3% chance of victory. Sharp punch. Got him set up in the corner of the ring. Oh, an overhand punch. Catches Knight with a counter. Fishing for something beneath the ring. A baseball bat? With a rubber like that, Clay, this is not going to be good. Oh, what a shot. Really swinging wildly now. Some 
superstars are understandably hesitant to exploit the no disqualification stipulation. Then they need to go wrestle a different match. This is the kind of match where you need to cross the line before the opposition does. If a superstar wants the W, they need to overcome that hesitation. Strikes with a kick. Oh, what a close line. Oh, man! Ouch. And that intensity of bronze got tapered down a bit there. Ooh! took over in that moment. Nothing but blind rage. Oh, man, check out this power. Morella press slam. Evades the attack. Vicious right forearm. Close fist connects. Face buster. Boom. Oh, did you hear that? Double axe handle. And he's taking this to the outside now. Ooh, treading all over their opponent. Oh, no. Now that he has the kendo stick, I definitely do not want to be in his path of destruction. Yeah. And L.A. Knight wants more from the top. Diving shoulder tap. He could pin his opponent right here. Gets the shoulder up well. What's it going to take? I think this match still has a ways to go. Ooh, ooh. Oh, ouch. Saw that one coming. Knight denies the attack. Caught with the boot. He must have had that scouted. Compromised position here. Right across the lyrics. Well, that'll do some serious damage. Oh my gosh, what impact. Looking for more damage here. Release back suplex. This match grinded him down a little. Knight looking like a sort of... Does he get it here? And he stops the count. And he's able to reverse. And now he's looking to lock in this submission. Impressive display. Whoa, whoa, look at that. And somehow he's able to work his way out of the hold. Knight was ready for that. Boom! Boot! Nice. What a shot! Setting up. Laid down with a power bomb. That could be curtains for Knight. Broken up. And the match continues. Uh-oh, this is not going to end well. Big time power bomb for the win. Still only got one. I don't know what more this superstar can do to put him away. Another reversal. Eye for an eye here. Double punch. He's going for the pin. This could be it. And to the pay window. with a kick to the gut. Connecting on the DDT. Question for you guys, whose game is it? And he saw that coming from Knight, and he heads out of the ring. No count outs, no worries. Switched it up and hit the DDT. Oh man, a kendo shot to the head. That can't feel good. Here's the cover for the win. And he only stays down for a one count. This is where great cardio makes all the difference, helping you stay alive deep into the match. Oh, torturous knee. Beautiful gainer roll. Great way to disorient your opponent. Oh, swung for the fences. Whoa, slamming that bat down as hard as possible. Oh, what a close line. Forcefully delivered. Into a neck breaker. Close line to the back of the neck. His 
his opponent is just over. L.A. Knight kick to the gut. L.A. Knight with the BFT. Knight about to end this fight. And there's the win. Huge win here tonight. Here is your winner, L.A. Knight. Quite the performance from all three superstars in this match. This was an unpredictable one, but when it was all said and done, only one man could be left standing. One man out of three. It was always bound to lead to a little chaos. A self-proclaimed prodigy. Well, it's time to prove it tonight. The following contest is a triple threat match. Making her way to the ring from Laredo, Texas. The NXT Women's Champion, Roxanne Perez. Winner of the first ever Women's Breakout Tournament in NXT. And she's held Tag Team Gold and the NXT Women's Championship but it still feels like she needs to prove herself as a top dog in all of WWE. Corey, how do you think these superstars feel about competing here on Thanksgiving? They should feel honored, Cole. As you know, Thanksgiving has a long-standing tradition of being one of the more prestigious nights on the sports entertainment calendar. She is a woman who is here to take control. And her opponents first, representing damage control from San Jose, California, the WWE Women's Champion, Bayley. The thing I love about Bayley is every word she speaks, every action she takes just says, I'm better than you. Oh, she took the helm when she created damage control and now an all-out assault on the women's division and the WWE fans. I feel like Bailey has gone out of her way to show that she's on her own level now. All great leaders lead by example. Bailey's demonstrating and the rest of the world should be taking notes. Well, if Bailey is such a great leader, tonight she's got a chance to actually back it up. And guys, what a thrill it must be for these superstars to compete here on Thanksgiving. Especially considering what this day has meant to this industry over the years. For decades, Thanksgiving was considered one of the biggest nights of sports entertainment. And that tradition continues here tonight. She is a true fan favorite. And representing the Judgment Day from Elmwood Park, New Jersey. The WWE Women's World Champion, Liv Morgan! Liv Morgan likes to say, watch me. Well, she's about to get what she wants because tonight it's all eyes on her. Indeed, we're going to watch Liv and see what she's capable of here tonight. She looks fired up. Look at the eyes pivoting on each of these three competitors in this triple threat match. Set for action in this one. And we are getting underway with Roxanne Perez, Bailey, and Liv Morgan. Every superstar for themselves in this matchup. Still, it's possible to see some temporary alliances, no matter how strange. It's about getting the odds in your favor. Chances are better against one opponent instead of two. A shin breaker. Nasty dragon screw. Bam! 
God, what a slap. Uh-uh. That's going to fire you up with anger. Here's the cover. And there's the breakup just in the nick of time. Shoulder tackle. Reversal. Can she capitalize? Her shoulders are down. Guillotine applied. Not going to lie. Fighting desperately. Able to shrug off her opponent. Big form. A no DQ stipulation means you have to throw your regular playbook out the window. Because it's not going to save you here. It's time to get extreme. You make a good point, Corey. Everyday offense just isn't going to cut it in this kind of match. And with an onslaught of strikes like that, it's clear they have nothing but punishment on their mind. Ooh! Oh, Liv got caught with a reversal. And misses on the springboard. Series of elbows looking to create separation. She does so. And Roxanne had it scouted. Oh, my gosh. Terminating knee smash. Looking for something, anything under the ring. Shades of the old EC dub as a kendo stick is introduced to the proceedings. This could do it. That could have been it right there. Come on. There's no fair play in that. Great way to completely disrupt the momentum and buy yourself some time. Lands face first. And Liv's usual persistence only got squished there. Party's over. Good night. She faked her out. Running interference. Oh, my God. Look at this. Double suplex. A brief instance of teamwork here, but how long is it going to last? Shinbreaker, not done yet. Dragon screw, beautiful. Nice running crossbody. Drops an elbow. What now? Oh, yikes, a stomp to the guts. Jeez, oh, she can end it here. She kicks out with authority. This isn't even close to over. Boom, kick. The usually prepared Bailey didn't look like she was expecting that move. Morgan put her whole heart behind that attack.
These women have not given each other any breathing room. No one is showing any signs of backing down. Cover. And gets the win, beating the odds in this triple threat. Here is your winner, Bailey. Quite the impressive victory coming out on top against two very capable, very prepared competitors. To win a triple threat match, you need incredible skill, instincts, or luck. Dare I say, tonight's winner showed all three in victory. Oh, 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 are you guys ready? The following contest is a triple threat match. Making his way to the ring from Toronto, Ontario, Canada, weighing in at 225 pounds, the NXT Champion, Ethan Page. Just look at the swagger on display. I love it. Swagger. Really, Saxton? You know a number of people in the back just despise this superstar. Well, the WWE Universe clearly disagrees with you, Corey. Oh, and what else is new? The American Nightmare has arrived. The son of a dream looking to realize his destiny in WWE. And his opponents, first from Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 220 pounds, he is the undisputed WWE Universal Champion, the American Nightmare, Cody Rhodes! He does have to be impressed with the form that Cody Rhodes has taken. He's become a leader, a mentor, and a main eventer. Those are all great things to be, Saxton, but we all know what Cody truly wants to be more than anything else is a world champion. Hard times and perseverance, Cody Rhodes embodies them all. All in the name of finishing the story that has eluded his father. Cody seems dead set on reaching the pinnacle in the name of the Rhodes family. Gunther is here and ready to prove that the mat is sacred. And representing Imperium from Vienna, Austria, weighing in at 297 pounds, he is the World Heavyweight Champion! Gunther's all business. There is very little wasted motion in this man when he gets going. Well, there may be roadblocks in his path, but Gunther's dominance has shown no signs of slowing. Record-breaking reigns with the NXT UK and Intercontinental titles. He's put away main eventers and future Hall of Famers while defending those titles.
A classic triple threat match now underway. No telling how this is going to go. Temporary alliances, sneak attacks, an all-out brawl. Place your bets now, gentlemen. Anything and everything is on the table. Set up in the corner of the ring. Uh-oh. He switches it back around. Oh, just manhandling their opponent. And there's a fallaway slam. <laughs> I honestly can't believe we just saw a human being tossed like that. Baseball bat. I know that'll prove the hell out of you. Gunther cuts him off. Oh! Hits the cutter. And now this is the right move. Get out of dodge and collect yourself. Only a one count before the kick out. Frankly, he should have known that wasn't enough. Oh, twisting the neck. Chop. Lighten up the chest. German suplex. A match like this can have so many twists and turns. Corey, what will have an impact on this matchup? You need to strike first. Dictate the pace of the match. Since anything goes, you can add anything to the equation. Each competitor responds differently to the rules being thrown out the window. The key is who can stay alert and remain in control. I wish someone would throw you out a window. Brutal boot. Oh, look at that torch of their opponent. Uh oh, this isn't gonna be good. Oh, man. Back body drop. And Guther looking a little less dignified himself after absorbing that blow. In full control here. Face full of turnbuckle. Whatever's plan here can't be good. Oh, and is able to battle out of the grips to some safety. Ooh. Using the ropes. Oh, man. Really just laying it in. So is unable to get there and count this pin. Big forearm. Hoisted up, double underhook. Weaves out. Countered with a vicious clothesline. He got whipped into that corner. <laughs> Setting it up. Thunderous clothesline. He can do it here. And there's the breakup, just in the nick of time. Here's the pump handle. Suplex launched. Hoisted up. Emerald frozen. Cody's eyes look glazed over. Statement DDT. And what a maneuver we just saw there. Springboard up. Expected that one. All the way up for a suplex. No, 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 no. Wiggles free. Escapes and a chop block takes him down. Look at that insult to injury with Rose has his opponent. Nails the crossroads. Cody's put a lot of competitors out with that. Cody's powerless here. Driven down. Neck breaker excellently executed. Saw that one coming, took advantage. Swinging neck breaker connects. Shot to the chest. Taking a moment to get... Body slam slipped out. Inverted DDT. I don't know what they're looking for here. Shorty Rhodes procures a sledgehammer. Ready to smash another throw. Now 
the time to find that second win. Find that rush of adrenaline to push you forward. That should do it right. This is no time to hesitate. You can feel the end coming. Fires back with a crucial elbow. Getting set up for something in the corner. Driven down. Cover! There's two! No, he gets the shoulder up. And you gotta think, he's just one final blow away from not kicking out next time. Oh, what a clothesline. Back elbow, and then a this looks like the setup to powerbomb position. Fighting out. Hammering away with punches to the face. There's the bulldog. What energy in this arena time. Figure four leg lock applied. Give up now. Swampy breaks the hold. Sledgehammer to the midsection will knock the wind out of you. He wants it one more time. Going up. Uh oh. But right hands create separation and an escape. Running Bulldog. He may get the three count right here. I think so. Lives to fight another day. Oh, a neck breaker. Shot to the chest. Bam! Down he goes. Finds the room to land a back elbow. What a drop kick. And this has got to be it. Oh, and he breaks up the pin. Strong right for him. He's in a bad way, guys. Yeah, he's got to dig deep and find another win if he wants to stay in this. Heads out, and he has all the time he wants. Bringing out that kendo stick means he is truly willing to go to the extreme. And of course, kendo sticks are always under the ring in the event of any rogue ninja attacks. Setting up. This whole building is shaking. Matches like this are what it's all about. He's burying elbows in the midsection. Brought back into the ring from the floor now. And he tosses him back in now. Neck breaker excellently executed. And he's able to counter. What an uppercut. That'll cost some teeth. He knew that was coming. A sequence of reversals there. Oh, hold on. One handed. Jumping suplex. Close line. And he's out of there in a nick of time. Uh-oh. This isn't going to be pretty. Suplex! Does he have him here? And a kick out at two. The muscle memory's got to be taken over now. Pure instinct to kick out before three. Hurricane Rana, ideal meal. Connects the fist to the face. Great counter. Beautiful. Close line. So effective. The ring general driven down with the power ball. It's all good thirst for the taking. Real European uppercut. Working on the leg. He's taking this to the floor now. Respect. Looking for a scoop slam. No, slips behind. Inverted DDT. <laughs> Using the ropes. Cover here. Kicks out. This is going to come down to who wants it more. Cody. Looking to put his opponent on Dream Street. Crossroads. This match has been history in the making. 
This is insane! Boom! Running STO plants him. Nicely done. Regal punch! Outside of the ring now. What's the plan here? He grabbed the chair. Now would be a good time to run. He has an answer for Rhodes. And this might not have a pleasant ending. Down on the windpipe. Into the gut. What's next? All the way out. Crucifix. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. It's over. Gunther is done. And he has free reign to the outside with no count outs to worry about. Well, no one's paying attention to you, Saxon. They're too busy beating the tar out of each other. The slits are not going to come from that. Oh. Every successive move is putting their opponent in a dicey situation. And you can tell there are true intentions in mind right now. with a swift elbow to the gut. Uh-oh. Now would be the time for everyone to clear out. Easier said than done. They are not concerned about anyone else's well-being. Gunther quick to the counter. Goes under the ropes to get back inside. And he slides him back to the mat. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. Oh, look at this. Just cranking the head. That's got to hurt. Just cranking the head. This isn't going to be pretty. Nice suplex. Oh, just got hit by a flying bat without the wings. Rose about to head to the pay window. Crossroads. Rose just turned the lights out. Gunther just can't seem to stop this offense. Yeah, somehow Gunther has to turn the tide. Broken, keeping the match alive. Bam! He went right into that turnbuckle. Uh oh. Uh oh is right. Package pile driver. This one is headed outside, guys. He's about to do it. He's about to do it again. For that. And just like that, it's all over. This could do it! Words off the pin at two. I am in shock. What's it going to take to keep this guy down? Sharp elbows to the body, looking to fight his way out. Oh, my God, a close line. Uh, off the rope. It's always disorienting. Muscles up there, a pole up and driven down with Emerald Flungeon. Gunther, get taste victory now. Looking for a scoop slam, but from behind, inverted DDT. Hurling the back through the air and connecting.
tremendous victory in this triple threat match. A win like this sends a message. Send two superstars, send three, send four, heck, send a whole army. It's only going to be an uphill battle for the competition. Here comes Big Bronson Reed. The following contest is an elimination match. Introducing first from Black Forest, South Australia, weighing in at 330 pounds, Bronson Reed. Bronson Reed tips the scales at over 330 pounds, but is the agility of a man half his size. Though when that tsunami comes crashing down, you'll know you ain't facing a cruiserweight. Bronson Reed is indeed ready for war. I have a feeling we're just moments away from another jaw-dropping, pardon me, Stu, tsunami! The best in the world. CM Punk made his return with a flood of emotions, but he knows he now has unfinished business and a story of his own to complete. After nearly a decade away from WWE, Punk can still compete at a high level, and he'll need that with today's competitors. A polarizing figure, but Punk is determined to be the best. Superstars feel about competing here on Thanksgiving? They should feel honored, Cole. As you know, Thanksgiving has a long standing tradition of being one of the more prestigious nights on the sports entertainment calendar. The Scottish Warrior has arrived. A multi-time world champion and a Royal Rumble winner. And to this day, one of the toughest fighters in WWE. Scottish Warrior outlasted 29 other superstars to win the 2020 Royal Rumble match and then carried that momentum all the way 
to WrestleMania, where he became WWE Champion. This just went from a match to a fight. And from Moscow, Russia. We have seen before what Dragunov is capable of, and it is scary. And let me take this opportunity to say happy Thanksgiving to all of you watching tonight. I gotta say, I don't know if it's because I ate too much turkey or if it's just Saxton's commentary. It's a good thing this match coming up is gonna give me a little boost. It's Saxton's commentary. We're in for a brawl with Kevin Owens tonight. With KO, it's a brawl every night. And from Maryville, Quebec, Canada, weighing in at 266 pounds, Kevin Owens! Throughout his career, KO has let it be known he will fight anyone, anywhere. Truly, Kevin Owens has no hint of fear in his being. I hope everybody enjoyed their turkey as we prepare to kick this match off momentarily. You know what, guys? Aside from my family, I can't think of two other people I'd rather spend Thanksgiving with. Uh, In fact, I go so far as to say that you guys are like family to me. Uh, Happy Thanksgiving, fellas. The Apex Predator is on the hunt. And from St. Louis, Missouri, weighing in at 275 pounds, the Viper, Randy Orton! A storied career with plenty of historic wins. Yeah, Randy has every right to rest on his accomplishments, but he hasn't kept evolving his game, continuing to grow as a competitor. That's exactly, Michael, why Randy Orton is so dangerous. In fact, you could say that Randy Orton is better now than ever before. Corey, how do you think these superstars feel about competing here on Thanksgiving? They should feel honored, Cole. As you know, Thanksgiving has a long-standing tradition of being one of the more prestigious nights on the sports entertainment calendar.
the one, the only, Logan Paul. And from Cleveland, Ohio, weighing in at 205 pounds, Logan Paul! There are folks in the crowd, on social media, heck, even backstage, who resent Logan Paul because he's a celebrity who shot to WWE superstardom. Well, some people believe Paul didn't pay his dues and he's an entitled celebrity. You know what? Those people can put in the work to make themselves a star like Logan Paul did. Until then, shut your mouth and immerse yourself in the Logan Paul experience because he's serving it up. Put your hard hats on. Logan Paul's about to go to work and someone's about to catch some hands. A promising young talent with a lot of swagger. And from Boston, Massachusetts, weighing in at 210 pounds, Carmelo Hayes! This guy has future star written all over him. A winner of the 2021 NXT Breakout Tournament, multiple-time NXT North American Champion, and unified that title with the Cruiserweight Championship. He's got a cocky attitude, but a bad habit of backing it up. And guys, what a thrill it must be for these superstars to compete here on Thanksgiving. Especially considering what this day has meant to this industry over the years. For decades, Thanksgiving was considered one of the biggest nights of sports entertainment. And that tradition continues here tonight. And we are locked and loaded for this tag team matchup. As we get this battle underway, we're about to see Bronson Reed, CM Punk, Drew McIntyre. And Ilya Dragunov. Then the opposing team is, of course, filled with Kevin Owens, Orton, Logan Paul, and Carmelo Hayes. You know this is a tough match for superstars who don't play well with others. You really need to find a way to properly mix your skills with your partners. That's a free fall. Here's the cover. And there's the kick out. He couldn't make much of that pin attempt. Owens high risk. Taking flight. Diving splash from the top. Incredible impact. And now, just end this now. Oh, he's playing possum. Kevin Owens kicks out easily. Too easily. Could be in search of a second win now. Oh, right in there. Into the corner now. right here with that display. Oh, now can he score the pin? Oh, uh, maybe. Oh, my. How in the world did he kick out of that? Got to change something up with the pin technique. And Reed with a counter. Uh, tag made. Oh, man. The communication between these two is evident by that move. McIntyre gets met with a response. With the reversal. Escape just in time. Here come the bombs. Practically never-ending blows coming at full force here. Belly to belly. Just mounted with punches and not and a Oof. stop to the gut, too. Caught in a bad position here. Getting tossed around. Just got thrown around like a sack of you know what. Way up and down hard. Grass 
crashing down like that, having the wind knocked out of you, never a good time for that to happen. Blink and you miss it. Power slam by Orton. Raining down right hands. That was a vicious display. You can almost see the disdain in their eyes. And a Oof. stop to the gut, too. Oh, oh. stop right to the hand. Each of those boots seem to get heavier with each blow. The stomp in every single part of his body. Look at this, just unloading. Oh, right to the gut. Merciless attacks from the Viper. Orton loves to have this kind of control. Oh, stomping away. Orton looks a little less dangerous after taking that attack. Oh, he retaliates. Neckbreaker. Ouch. Oh, look at this. Just cranking the head. That's got to hurt. in the head. Look at this. Just unloading. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. The WWE Universe is pouring more fuel on his fire right now. Oh, saw it coming and got an elbow for their trouble. Showing some extra scouting. And here's a cover. A kick out, and you can see the frustration starting to build. He is certainly sending a message, getting his shoulder up before two. Goodness gracious. And repeated impacts like that will weaken you mentally as much as it does physically. And a neckbreaker! Good. That was nasty. Look out! Big splash! to three. And the referee gets caught in the line of fire. In off the tag. The adrenaline is pumping and the WWE Universe is on his side. What a splash! There he goes, right into the corner. Uh-oh! Crocodile fires back. Suplex. And that holds Dragon off back. Oh my god, a DDT! Spike them. He's tagging out. Able to get there in time. Headbutt to the back of the neck. Incoming. Out of the floor. That is the attitude of a daredevil. The ability to take risk with minimal trepidation. No fear, absolute reckless abandon. Boom! Kick! Uh oh. Cross the shoulders. Air raid crash. No one likes a count out. Claymore delivered. McIntyre might have him. Delivers down. And he stops the count for his partner. The Kimura. The Kimura. Uh, Kimura lock. Submission move. Will they tap? Uh, it's KO. He doesn't yeah. have much time before his arm snaps. Great job fighting out. Gets the tag. Perhaps thinking about what to do next here. Have you ever seen a human being tossed like that? Counters that. Boom, right across 
the small of the back. Stops the attack with a hit to the gut. Placed in the corner. Here he comes off the tag. Boom! What a right comes. In the clothesline. Gets the tag. Oh, man, he is more than fired up right now. Sidewalk slam. Up the turnbuckles. Oh, Logan's chances are dwindling. Two. Now we have Orton. Hook them up. Script on him there. Oh, huge splash. Right to the knee. Oh, my God. Into the corner he goes. A perfectly placed target. to do next. Driven down face first. Solely focused on punishing the leg. He's getting pushed out into the defensive. Yeah, they've stuck it out through this match, but it wouldn't hurt to go for the tag soon here. Every ounce of the body is a target. Shots to the body. Heavy hands right to the gut. Got his opponent in hand. Face Buster. He made it. Tag made. How insulting is that? German suplex spiked. Yes, tag. Looking for a high risk, high reward situation. Oh, what an uppercut, John. Scattered reversal there. Boom! Shifts it back onto him. From behind! German suplex. Ooh, stiff punch. Placed into the corner. Oh, and Ilya turns the tables. Torpedo Moscow. Drag it off by just have it. Makes a cover. Whoa, what a save. That should have been three. And now back to Randy Orton. Oh, okay. oh. And that can keep dragging off down. Hoist it up into the snap suplex. You have to imagine we're hitting the late stages of this matchup. Who's going to dig deeper at this point? It might just take that extra push, that extra inch further to create the difference. with a kick to the gut. Oh, the driver spiked him. Whip back into the ring. Oh! Waist lift. Yeah, Ross Howard there. Fine buster. Senton connects. The switch here to Drew McIntyre. Oh, yeah, the wherewithal to counter McIntyre. 
Randy Orton. Classic Orton. Reaches his partner for the tag. Oh, wow. Countered with a stiff headbutt. Incapacitating the shoulder. A defensive elbow to the gut ends that. Uh-oh. Stunned. Owens stunned. Owens got out of it. Two. And Dragunov. And a tag there. Just mounted with punches. And, not, and a Oof. stop to the gut, too. Drop kicked all the way to the floor. Quick thinking pays off. This is going to get ugly. Air raid crash neck breaker. Is it enough? The cover. Now we have Owens. McIntyre looking to put an end to his hunt. Kick to the gut. Uh-oh. And uses the arm drag to reverse. Try to end it. And referee cuts off the count in one. The fact that these superstars can still be moving at this point is beyond the realm of reality. Inverted DDT. Carmelo Hayes firing up. Tag is made, and he's coming in hot. Up and... Oh, knee right to the spine. Ooh. That flat... This was all but over. His arm shot off the mat before one. I was not expecting that from him at this point. And he sends him into the corner. Uh-oh. He turns it around. Crushing impact in the corner, and an elbow for good measure. These superstars have toiled away endlessly, and this crowd is on their feet in full appreciation. An incredible sight to see. Can't prepare your face for that. I guess that's one way to incite your opponent. He's getting a huge boost right now from all those chants and cheers. Tag is made, and here we go. Owens intercepts it. What a hit from Owens. And the DDT. Oh, my goodness. Dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. To stop Owens. Placing them right where they want them into the corner. Shoulders down! He kicks out at two. What do you have to do to put this guy away? Boom, what a kick. We know what's coming next. What more can be done at this point? Able to reverse that one. Whoa, drop kick all the way to the outside. Oh, my! Ah, look at this. So much damage inflicted. Punk scaling the turnbuckles. From the top rope, flying elbow drop. 
Not much fight left in KO, it seems. Trying to work the arm. Now in control. Now starts to fight out with some punches to the gut. A oh, double knee face breaker. Oh, he's looking to completely render this leg useless. Stump puller leg snap. Very effective. Randy Orton with the tag. Taking heavy fire in the corner in the form of a series of clotheslines. Back suplex. Lightning fast power slam by Orton. Cover. Two. Forces the shoulder up after two. Really had less than a second to stay alive there. There he goes, right into the corner. Look at this, going right after the left arm. Gotta hurt. He reverses it. Oh, look at this. Float over the neck breaker. Picture perfect. The Viper able to strike back. Orton with an exploder suplex. The body is starting to fail at this point. And he has just taken an extraordinary amount of abuse. Nice combo. Pull oh, man. Shot right to the midsection. Shot to the face gets him out of that spot. It's absolute pandemonium in here. And it's all because of the willpower these superstars are showing. Northern Lights suplex. here placing them into the corner close line after close line in the corner my goodness what a barrage and not done yet back suplex will it be he keeps his team in the match now looking at kevin owens Beautiful neck breaker after the float over. That was pretty. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. The Viper is facing a bit of danger here. Looks like Orton's struggling here. No, 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 no. 
Oh, oh man! Slick shot DDT off the apron. He skirts away, living to fight another day. Uh-oh. Drag it off out of harm's way. Suplex! Driven into the barricade. Ilya toying with his opponent a little bit. He's back in so close to a countout. You do not want to lose that way. Instead delivers the inverted DDT. Dragunov is just oozing charisma right now. And tag, he did it. Let's go. Uh, mistake made by Logan Paul. Big, big back body drop. What else? It is beyond electric in here. This energy is on another level. Boom! <laughs> and Raganoff showing that he's still not done going on the offensive. Certainly a worrisome scenario for Paul at this juncture. Launching himself from the coast to coast. Shoulders down. Still got more fight here. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. Ilya takes hold. Uh oh. Punch straight to the face, stays off the attack. Uh-oh. 
He saw it coming, taking advantage. What are you waiting for? Get back in there. You tell him, Saxton. A oh, clubbing blow to the back. Oh. And Reed adds to the damage he's already handed out. We know KO loves to fight, but he might not be able to take much more of this. And Logan Paul was just eliminated. Wow. Counter into an inverted DDT. This could do it. He gets the kick out after the one. It's hard to believe, but it looks like he still has some gas left in the tank. Placed into the corner. to look in his eye here, folks. Stirring back to his feet, but he might not know where he is. Blast off. Hands, nothing but net. Will Bronson get back up? He keeps his team in the match. And now we see Punk. Oof. Retaliated with a knee to the face. Kick to the lower back. KO lining it up. Could be just moments. Uh oh. And we have moments. KO, we're about to sew this up. Uh oh. Uh oh, well scouted by Reed. Uh oh. Cross the shoulders. Uh-oh, pulling the hair into a mat slam. Tag is registered. DDT. He went right into that turnbuckle. Ross is their opponent down. Middle rope launch with a moonsault. And there's the cut. Out before the two count. You expect these pins to last much longer at this stage in the match. Oh, a fourth to the back of the neck. And Drew getting it taken to him in a major way. It's a testament to Owen's toughness that he might be able to pull this off. It's a no good driver. And McIntyre is showboating right now. Got the tag. Got the tag. He finds a counter to McIntyre there. Carmelo Hayes. Gonna turn a suplex into the car. Drew is completely out of it. Cover! Oh! Come on, ref, get some control. Shut up, Byron. Uh-oh, countered it just in time. Tough position to be caught in here. Locked face, this couldn't do it. Now McIntyre. Eliminated, and that will end Carmelo Hayes' night. Just one step ahead. Trying to debilitate the capability to stand. He's turning the tables. Hooked up in a pump handle. And a neck breaker! Yes, that was nasty. He was waiting for him to make his move. Left by the turnbuckles. Keeping him in this one. That should have been it. 99% of the time it is. Orton is seeing red right now. And he's got more work to do here. Oh, look at that scope slam. 
with perfect precision. A knee drop. The voice is clearly telling Orton to put Drew down. from Orton. And this is going to mark the end of the road for Drew McIntyre. He has to go to the back now. Get him in the corner. Knife edge chop echoing through the arena. Randy Orton gets him back. Ooh, jarring European uppercut. Oh, that got turned around on Reed. From the top, swan time bomb. Cover. Two count. That's it. Bronson Reed just got eliminated. DDT. Beautiful. Float over neck breaker. Picture perfect. Shaky. The end of the track for him could be near. Randy Orton. There it is. There's two. And they get the win. Outlasted every other team tonight. Here are your winners. The team of Kevin Owens, Randy Orton, Logan Overcoming all those superstars to have their arm finally raised up high. Yeah, with an elimination match, your number can be up at any moment. But they've managed to outmaneuver all the other competitors here tonight.